The top 10 foods to unclog your arteries naturally. Your arteries may become stiff and clogged up with plaque as you get older which raises the risk of having a heart attack, a stroke or a blood clot in fact clogged arteries are the leading cause of death in the world. Plaque usually forms here when there is first inflammation in the artery walls which may be caused by eating too many refined carbohydrates and vegetable oils. Smoking and tobacco use and high blood pressure or high stress levels can also cause it. Fortunately however there are lots of studies and research papers that discuss healthy foods that can help to unclog the arteries naturally and keep the blood flowing freely through the vascular system. And these will be the topic of this video, just a quick reminder this video is for educational purposes only so do speak with your doctor if you have any medical concerns. One of the healthiest foods for your arteries is black garlic. Eating black garlic in a regular daily salad can help to prevent plaque and hardening in the arteries as you age. This is just regular garlic that's been aged and fermented giving it a milder sweeter flavor without the usual pungent smell. Black garlic contains a very powerful sulfur compound called SAC, which is an antioxidant that can heal artery walls from oxidative damage. Food number two is sardines and anchovies. One of the simplest things that you can do to help unclog your arteries is simply eating a can of wild sardines or some anchovies on a daily basis. Make sure to rinse off any processed oil that may be present in the can or alternatively you can simply use fresh fish. These fish are loaded with EPA and DHA 2 omega-3 fats which have been shown to help clean out the arteries, improve the ratio of LDL to HDL cholesterol, and also naturally lower high blood pressure. Number 3 is whole lemons. Studies show that a harmful type of bacteria usually present in the mouth can also invade the artery walls. This causes them to become very damaged, and inflamed and then they get patched up with calcium and cholesterol plaque. In order to clear out this harmful bacteria blend two cups of water with a whole unwaxed lemon making sure to include the pulp the juice the seeds and the outer peel to make what's called real lemon water. Feel free to add stevia and drink this on a daily basis to help protect the entire cardiovascular system of your body. Next up we have extra virgin olive oil. Extra virgin olive oil is a key part of the Mediterranean diet, and it's well known for lowering the risk of heart disease. This is an excellent source of polyphenol oleic acid and vitamin E all of which help to strengthen your blood vessels. By improving endothelial function and reducing oxidative damage. Consuming just 1 to 2 tablespoons of this per day raw and drizzled over your salad is an amazing way to help unclog your arteries. Just quickly I'd be so grateful if you could hit the like button subscribe and turn all notifications on so that I may keep you updated with the latest health and nutrition tips. Next up is sauerkraut. Plaque in your arteries becomes dangerous after it oxidizes, because it sort of hardens into a bone-like texture with lots of calcium. Fortunately there is a powerful nutrient called vitamin K2 which helps to remove this calcium from the soft tissues of the arteries and put it into the bones where it belongs. Sauerkraut is a good source of vitamin K2, but you can also get this from salami and hard cheeses like parmigiano, munster, or emmental cheese. Food number 6 may surprise you, it's grass-fed beef. Now it's commonly believed that red meat is harmful to the heart and the arteries, as it may raise cholesterol levels. However the evidence actually shows that high-quality grass-fed beef can help to reduce plaque in the arteries. Meat that comes from grass-fed and grass-finished cows contains high levels of conjugated linoleic acid, this is a very healthy fat which lowers inflammation, reduces the risk of heart disease, improves the balance of LDL and HDL cholesterol and also helps to keep blood pressure under control. The seventh food is capers. Quercetin is a yellow-colored pigment found in many different foods like onions, 
grapes, cherries, and citrus fruits. This is a phytonutrient which blocks thromboxane A2 in the body, reducing the risk of dangerous clots from clogging your arteries and triggering a heart attack or a stroke. Capers are actually some of the richest sources of this quercetin tin in the world and they're often used in Mediterranean cuisine and they taste good with a tuna salad or perhaps some deviled eggs. Cucumbers are also fantastic when it comes to improving blood flow around the body and helping the arteries to stay flexible. Citrulline found in cucumbers, melons and squash turns into nitric oxide when you consume it from your food. This is like a gas which dilates and opens up the blood vessels to keep your blood pressure stable and reduce stiffness in the arteries. Food number 9 is Pumpkin Seeds. Start to eat 2 tablespoons of pumpkin seeds on a daily basis to majorly improve the health of your heart and your cardiovascular system as a whole. The high magnesium content helps to prevent the calcium from building up and the cholesterol plaque in the arteries, whilst also reducing the risk of angina and heart palpitations. The phytosterols in pumpkin seeds also help to heal the lining of the blood vessels called the endothelium. And finally we have some tomatoes. There is a very special phytonutrient in tomatoes called lycopene which has been shown in many studies to reduce the oxidation of LDL cholesterol essentially this is protecting your arteries from further clogging whilst also healing your blood vessels against any existing damage. Cooking tomatoes actually makes you absorb four times more lycopene than eating them raw so feel free to make a delicious sauce made from tomatoes aged garlic and extra virgin olive oil. And serve this with your grass-fed beef for a very powerful artery cleansing meal. And lastly for this section I'd like to share with you some additional foods that also have anti-atherogenic properties. Wild salmon, blueberries, walnuts, flax seeds, green tea, turmeric, celery and avocados. How to unclog arteries. In order to unclog your arteries of cholesterol, fibrin and calcium plaque, it takes more than just adding healthy foods into your diet. It's important to correct your lifestyle as well using the following tips. Firstly, reduce processed foods. Start cutting out processed foods from your diet including things like sugar cereals, bread, soda, drinks, biscuits, pastries, pasta, and sweets. Instead, Start cooking your own meals at home and restaurant food is very often cooked using inflammatory omega-6 vegetable oils like soy cottonseed canola or corn oil which can cause plaque to form in your arteries. So start to cook your own healthy meals at home more often instead and get your heart healthy omega-3 fats by eating virgin cod liver oil, wild fish, shellfish, and walnuts. These will help to reverse inflammation in the inner walls of the arteries. There's also some supplements that you may be interested in consider taking 200 micrograms of vitamin K2 and 500 micro G of vitamin D3. These nutrients work together to direct calcium into your bones and prevent it from hardening inside your arteries. Next we have intermittent fasting. Studies show that people living in starvation during World War II had absolutely no plaque in their artery areas. This is because fasting helps to clean out the arteries. Simply start eating all of your calories for the day in a very strict 8-H hour window and drink only water for the remaining 16 hours of the day to help decalcify your arteries. Low Stress Exercise Start to take long solitary walks outside in nature for at least one hour per day with lots of fresh air to bring in more oxygen into your bloodstream. Trees and plants release essential oils into the air called phytoncides which can lower your blood pressure, reduce stress, and minimize the risk of heart attacks. And finally we have nutritional yeast. Start eating 2 to 3 tablespoons of nutritional yeast each day to supply B vitamins, especially niacin, B3, which can dilate and open up your blood vessels to prevent a blockage or even a blood clot. 
If you want to take a test to check the health of your arteries, speak to your doctor and request a coronary artery calcium CAC test. There are also some other vitamins and supplements available that can improve the health of your arteries. If you'd like to learn more about these check out the video that I've put on your screen. Now thanks once again for watching another of my videos. I wish you great health, wealth and happiness.